What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Vega and today we're going to be talking about the Fear of God Essentials Nylon Running Shorts and as always I'm going to go ahead and talk about the sizing, the quality, my personal thoughts. I'll even show you how they look on me and all of that good stuff just in case you are in the market for these shorts right here. I also have a quick little life update the feature of this channel which is going to be later on in the video at the end so to my og subscribers for those that really care i'll go ahead and talk about that at the end of the video that way i don't ruin the review for my new viewers but with that being said let's get right into the video All right, guys, let's get right into the video. As always, we have a black frosted back, or at least it's been the case for the last like four to five drops. And let's go ahead and read the skew just in case you are in the market for this specific pair of shorts. And that is one, six, zero, S as in Sam, U as an umbrella, two, 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 zero to one F as in Frank. And the color is smoke. I got this off the Essence website. And that's the first thing I wanna talk about, the color smoke let, let me ask you something when you think about the color smoke what do you think about because me for example i think about it's burning and i see smoke and i see a gray dark gray charcoal type of gray right that, that, that's what you see right definitely not this color uh, that's just my first complaint it looks good in person don't get me wrong but it's definitely not a color called smoke <laughs> it is really more of a champagne type of color it looks good in person but it's just not a color called smoke it's not a good color representation but let's go ahead and talk about the shorts the first thing that i noticed right off the bat is the different type of logo the essentials fear of god logo right there i mean i rather have the classic logo but it's okay nothing different you know nothing bad with this at least we have the little rubber tab right there towards the top of the shorts as always the strings are in the inside which is a nice little touch in my opinion just in case you don't want to like rock the strings out and it has a nice little uh, lace lock or pull tab that feels pretty premium as well now as far as the shorts the quality the quality is also very clean very nice i mean there's really no strings coming out of nowhere no weird threading nothing like that it's a very good clean pair of shorts and as far as the sizing and all of that good stuff let's go ahead and talk about that next because they're a little bit different however if you like volley shorts then you're definitely going to like these as well when it comes down to the sizing i would highly highly recommend that you go true to size like my true to size on nike paxon H&M is a large I got a large on this one and they fit well however there's other shorts that I have recommended from fear of God essentials in the past that you go down a size that is not the case with these go true to size and you should be good to go now they kind of remind me a little bit of the volley shorts as well from fear of God essentials if you have some of those volley shorts they're probably going to fit a lot alike but slightly a little bit different and one of the main differences from the volley shorts and these right here is the length the volley shorts fit right above the knee these fit pretty much mid thigh area which is kind of that modern look that we're going for right now in my opinion they look good it's nothing crazy it's not like a speedo or anything like that but if you have a problem with the length just sag them a little bit and you should be good to go on that now they are also a little bit more tapered on the sides the volley shorts for example tend to be a little bit more baggy to the side more like you know uh wide and if you get the wrong size you're gonna look like you have a parachute type of pair of shorts i don't know how to explain that but that's just the best analogy that i can give you but either way with these they're a little bit more tapered they're mid thigh area so if you like that look you should be good to go that's gonna be it for today's review if you are interested in getting something a little bit better than the volley shorts as far as like uh, quality is concerned and you want a modern fit i highly recommend that you get them just keep in mind the color smoke is really not there it's more of a champagne, satin, all of that good stuff. It's definitely going to look good for fall. Now, let's go ahead and talk about the life update, the feature of the channel, like I mentioned in the beginning of the video. Life update is, um, if you've been following me for quite some time, this specific year has been pretty tough on me um, because my father has been battling cancer. Um, it's been a roller coaster of emotions. I've mentioned this in the past, kind of, you know, 
you know, saying sorry for my absence because normally I tend to record every week, but my dad um, passed away. And um, this is the second time I'm doing this because the first time I said it, it hit me hard and it still hits me hard right now. I got like goosebumps. Um, I don't tend to talk about my personal life as much. You probably just know the surface only, um, but he did pass two weeks ago and it hits me in a different type of way than probably other people that might not have a good relationship with their father but I'm an only son I don't have brothers sisters so the bond between me and my dad was actually very good um and yeah man it, it's um it, it's an it's a feeling that I cannot describe I never felt this type of pain before um and it, it's de definitely very different so I wanted to share that just so you know um, what's been going on, um, what has happened for the last like eight months. You know, my dad was battling cancer, and honestly, man, like I, I don't tend to cuss, but f cancer, like it's 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 straight up how I feel. Like it took my father away, and so as far as the future of this channel, pretty much what that means is that I'm going to start recording more. I'm not going to quit. Um, you know, just because something bad happened in my life doesn't mean that I'm going to quit. It just means that I'm going to be able to record a little bit more, but just give me a little bit of a break as far as like what's been going on, because I don't think it's a, it's a normal scenario. It's not because I was just lazy and they don't want to record. Right. I mean, just lost my father. So I'm going to start doing weekly videos. Um, I'm going to try at least to start doing weekly videos. I'm going to bring more sneaker content. I'm going to talk about more fashion, more outfit ideas. Thank you so much for rocking with your boy. Thank you to the uh, new subscribers that have subscribed in the last couple of months, even though I haven't been recording as much. Uh, thank you for my OG subscribers. Thank you to my friends, family members that watch as well. Um, the future of the channel is going to keep on you know, going and um, hopefully we could bring more new stuff to the channel now that I have a little bit more time in my hands. So with that being said, if you haven't done it by now, go ahead and subscribe, help out your boy, smash the like button. It really does mean a lot. And also hit that bell. That way you get notified every single time I drop a video. Also, if you're not doing so, follow me on Instagram at carlosvega101. I'm always updating the date and time of my videos. And it's just a good way to keep up with me as well. With that being said, till next time, peace.